Hello friends, welcome to the class of cost and works accounting. We are solving the problems on cost sheet. So in this video, we are going to solve seventh problem. Let us start. This is the video. This is the disclaimer statement of this particular video. This is a cost sheet format which we are going to follow in solving the problem on cost sheet. So this problem, it came in 2019 April examination of regular students of Savitribai Phule Pune University. So first we need to see in whose books of accounts we are going to write it is Dale Limited Bhopal okay so expenses are given let us now bifurcate the expenses so opening stock of raw material A opening stock of finished goods I opening stock of work in progress E closing stock of raw materials a. Closing stock of work in progress. E. Closing stock of finished goods. I. Indirect labor. E. Lubricants. E. Insurance on plant. E. Purchase of raw materials. A. Sales Commission K Salaries to Salesman K Administrative Expenses G Right Carriage Outward K Power E Direct Labor B Depreciation on machinery E. Factory rent E. Property tax on factory building E. Donations to Chief Minister Relief Fund So you might be remembering we have shoot one video on non-cost item. So this is a non-cost item. So it will not come in the cost sheet. Okay, sales N. Okay, now let us start solving this problem. Okay, so I'll just quickly adjust my screen. Okay, so first what we need to write, we need to write in whose books of accounts we are going to write. So it is in the books of Bail Limited Bhopal. Next line, we need to write cost sheet. Next to it, we need to write the period. But in this particular example, period is not mentioned. So we'll just keep blank. Then, our, as per our format, we need to write number of unit produced and number of units sold, which is not mentioned over here. Okay. Then, we need to write we draw a column, three columns, particulars, total rupees and total rupees. So let us start. We will uh, do as per our format. So first we need to write A, right? A is direct material consumed, right? So here first will be the opening stock of raw material. What is the number? It is 40,000. Into that we need to add purchases how much are the purchases it is 4 lakh just do the total it is 4 lakh 40 thousand keep in inner column and minus the closing stock of raw material which is again 50,000 now minus this 50,000 from 4 lakh 40,000 that will be your direct material consumed okay 
it should be in the outer column okay not in the inner column next it is direct labor so all the time you need to see where exactly it is okay because we are going to uh, write as per our format so direct labor it is over here right see my cursor it is 3 lakhs so directly outer column we need to write 3 lakhs then next as per our format direct expenses but it is not mentioned so I'll keep blank or dash so next I'll put the total of this that is 6 lakhs 90 thousand this is our prime cost we have just added a b and c okay next next is e that is factory overheads so what are the factory overheads go one by one here now e e, e comes later on because it is an adjustment again e adjustment later on next indirect labor so we'll take indirect labor what is the amount it is 50,000 next lubricants 10,000 so 10,000 next insurance on plant it is 3,000 next next here power e 30,000 so we'll write power 30,000 next is uh, e depreciation on machinery 50,000 so depreciation on machinery 50,000 next here factory rain 60,000 we'll write factory rent 60,000 and last property tax on factory building it is e 11,000 I'll write over here okay we'll just do the total of this okay so I'll I'll write the total so it is how much will be the total I will use the formula sum into bracket and I'll just do the total okay so it is 2 lakh 14,000 okay I'll just add up this how much will be my total I'll just use the formula is equal to sum um, adjustment is there so uh, instead of this we'll do one thing I'll, I'll just delete this I'll do the total here okay so total is 2 lakh 40 thousand okay so we need to write now adjustment here adjustment is there opening stock of work in progress so adjustment on account of work in progress so add opening stock of work in progress it is 10,000 and I need to close uh, minus the closing stock of work in progress that is 150,000 so from this particular amount I need to subtract this amount and add this amount so total will be 74,000 so here I will do the total okay so total is 7 lakh 64 thousand this is my factory cost okay next is now G it is only one expenses that administration expenditure 1 lakh so I'll write 1 lakh directly in the outer column okay again I'll do the total and this is my cost of production okay so how I arrived this I did F figure and the G figure okay next it is I adjustment on account of stock of finished goods I'll add opening stock of finished goods and minus the closing stock of finished goods okay the respective totals are here so finally I need to add 86,000 to the 864,000 so this is 950,000 this is my cost of goods sold okay now 
selling and distribution expenditure just find k where is it a k sales commission k 60000 so i'll just write sales commission it is 60000 next um, salaries to the salesman so it is 1 lakh next is carriage outward so carriage outward it is 20000 i'll just do the total of this okay total of this so it is 180000 so i'll add this 180000 to the 950000 so that comes to 11 lakh 30000 this is my cost of sales okay and uh, profit they have not mentioned right so we need to find out the profit but for that purpose they have given the sales figure what is the figure sales it is 12 lakhs okay i'll just minus uh, this 11 lakh 30000 from 12 lakhs and that give me my profit okay so here i will so this is our total problem we have solved total problem profit is 70000 okay so i hope uh, you have understood this particular problem okay so this is again a disclaimer statement of this particular video for more videos, you can log on to the YouTube channel Rath Knowledge Bank. Thank you. Thank you very much.